today I'm going to be showing you guys how to hive a package of bees. This is the bees, um, three pound package of bees with a marked queen. She's hanging on a, in a queen cage in here. Um, you'll also need your painted box with 10 frames inside of, inside of it, just like that. You also need a hive tool and something sharp to pry over a cork out of the queen cage. I'll show you that also. Uh, sugar water sprayer. You're gonna use that so the bees wouldn't be flying around so they'll be cleaning themselves off um, and it's gonna be a little bit easier for you to hive a package with this. Um, also uh, entrance feeder. I used uh, just re regular plastic entrance feeder with a core jar filled up with sugar water. It's one to one ratio. One cup of water, one cup of sugar. Um, also some marshmallows. I'll show you what that's for. And last but not least, we'll use some kind of a piece of wood to cover the whole of the package when we're going to pull out the queen cage. And that's good. We'll just cover okay. it. Just like Remove and set aside about two or three frames out of the center of the box. So we'll just pull them out like that. Right here. And now we're ready to hive a package of bees. So what we're going to do first and uh, spray them with sugar water, uh, what's going to happen is their wings are going to be sticky to fly around. Some of them are still going to be flying around, but it's definitely going to keep them a little bit cooler and uh, they're not going to be flying too much. So we'll spray them on both sides. You don't want to spray too much, just a little bit on both sides, just like that. And after we do that, what we want to do is we want to shake the package just lightly so a cluster of the bees drops to the ground just like this and now you can see how you can see the scan over here very clearly and we're gonna pull out a um, queen we're gonna pull out the queen cage some bees might get out And then we're going to cover it with a piece of wood, just like this. And here's the queen, right there inside there. There's going to be some bees flying around, but what we're going to do is we're going to gently shake them into the box. Okay. And now we have the queen. There's this end over here is covered with a cork, so that's why we need something sharp. But be very cautious not to harm the queen. So what we're gonna do is get a do it very slowly and make sure that uh, you're not gonna pinch the queen when the queen is on the other side. As soon as you pull it out, make sure you cover it with your finger, just like so. Here's our queen, and as you can see, she has a white mark on the back of her. Uh, when she turns around, you'll be able to see that. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to need our marshmallows uh, to cover the hole that we pulled out the cork from. So make sure point it down away from the sun, and when she crawls up, that's when you want to cover it and stuff the marshmallow inside that hole. So just like that. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to get one of these paper clips like this and uh, try to secure it to the frame. So just unfold one of these and clip it on there. So when we're going to dump the bees, they're all going to smell her and they're going to eat out that marshmallow that we stuffed in the... And now here we're going to put the bees in the box. So what we're going to do is we're going to move this piece of wood like that and they're all excited to get out so we'll get the cage tip it over and start shaking them. they're all really excited to get out but there's still gonna be quite a few of them in the cage um, just because they're so used to being in the cage and you can see all the bees right over here inside now they're starting to crawl on and there's like I said some bees still in the box but we'll just leave this by the entrance and they're all gonna smell the queen and by uh, by this night you'll see how there's not gonna be a single bee in this cage over here.
all the bees are spreading, spreading along the frames and you can see how they're uh, crawling on the frames now what we're gonna do is we'll gently put these three frames back inside and uh, make sure you don't squish any bees one after another just like so and then we'll move this cage a little bit to the side and we'll get our action feeder which is one of these as I showed you before we're just gonna slide it in the entrance a little bit just to secure it in and then we're gonna get our sugar water just tip it over put it inside so they have some food to eat and build out the frames and that's how easy it is to hive a package of bees these will eat through the marshmallow in one to three days and that's when they're going to release the queen into the hive. At that point it's a good opportunity for you to put a pollen patty in there uh, to aid the uh, brood production in the hive and you're all done. You'll see how the bees are crawling inside. They're smelling the queen in the cage and one by one slowly they're flapping their wings and trying to find where the queen is and right there you can see how slowly one by one they're entering the hive.